We're live this afternoon from Blunston Arena. You join us for this T20 match between West Indies and Zimbabwe. I'm Mike Atherton, and next to me in the commentary position is Mel Jones, Ali Mitchell, Ian Healy, and the one and only David Gower. Hi, others. Looking forward to this one. I've just been taking a look at conditions down in the middle. And it's pretty apparent, even before you take a proper look, that they'll be looking at batting first on this pitch. It's very dry on top, and it could make any run chase later quite difficult. And as far as the weather goes, a beautiful day for cricket. You'll certainly need your sunnies. Brilliant work there from David Gower. Captains are ready for the toss. Let's join them in the middle. West Indies win the toss and looks like they'll have a bat. Certainly it looks like the conditions would favour that decision. The bowlers will need to keep things very tight. Players look ready. The umpires are in position for the first ball. The bowlers will want to focus on their line and lengths and let the ball do the rest. Yeah, yeah. That went all the way up toward the grandstand for four, driven away nicely. You can see how good this pitch can be for batting. You want the player coming forward, but it's a tight margin. Only a touch full and put away. Yep. Well, that would have been a very risky run. The right call was made in the end. Wait on. Nicely yeah, yeah. played. You could see by how it whistled away to the boundary just how sweetly this was timed. I'd like to see them aim for the top of off now. As a bowler, you've got to make them play on your terms. Yep. Great shot. At least one on offer. Really raced between the wickets after it was clipped away nicely behind square. A new batter always likes to feel bat on ball early on as they bring a bit of energy to the crease. Really good shot there. They're the sort of shots that you just stand and admire. Gets onto the back foot and rolls the wrist to keep control and find the boundary. Don't need to do anything special. Line and length is the key. Always back in the ball there, drives the ball away nicely and picked the gap at cover very well. Playing all their shots in that over, a very expensive over. Going with pace now. Simple as you like. Didn't bother to look at more than one delivery in the over. Well, this is a fantastic wicket. Get the runs down, 
really didn't get settled. Looked to be in trouble, sadly, for most of the knock. Difficult period as they come to the wicket. They'll take plenty of time to set themselves up before facing their first ball. Yep. It mightn't get to the boundary, should at least get a couple. Good throw from the deep, on target. Exquisitely down the front foot, a gorgeous looking drive, could have been worth more. Yep. They'll get at least one. Keep us in. There'll be one run here for them. What great yeah. reactions, brilliant catch, close in. Oh dear, it's been a poor innings under pressure, and now they've got the key batter out cheaply. With the fall of that wicket, the new batter comes out to the crease. They're quick to take guard and face up. Wait, yeah. Ease through the field. There'll be runs here. Just a little bit wide. Well picked up. And let the ball do all the work, really, just to nudge it down towards third. That's really high. Don't think anyone is close. End of the over. Nine off it. West Indies are two for 26. The right arm medium bowler is coming on to bowl from the river end. Well placed. Should get a single. Whipped away nicely through the leg side, elegant as ever, and picking up good runs. Wait. Collects that one, simple as you like, inside the ring. Puran shakes their head. It was there to hit, couldn't make the most of it. It. Oh, Confident appeal. Could it be? Glove? Is there glove? There is glove. An innings that promised much and really, in the end, delivered very little. Pretty disappointing all round. A lot of pressure coming to the crease. Not had the best of weeks leading up to this game and will want to show everyone their strength. Misses everything. Muzarabani with a superb delivery. Got them trying to drive, but messing everything up. Brilliant bowling. Having got the edge the previous ball, they now know the areas they need to be hitting. Waiting. Thought it got past them, but a fantastic dive to cut it off. Oh, tight. Just got home with a wicket-saving dive. Wait. The end of a tidy over. Batting doesn't seem to be easy out there at the moment. Good pressure building. We're on. 
just threw the shot too early. Yep. There'll be runs here. Couple on offer here. Got forward well and was able to drive the ball. A lovely shot and good running. Yep. Sounded good the moment it hit the bat. Just need one of the cameramen to send that one back. A little bit of width, but clinically put away. Getting nicely settled at the crease now. Would have been really happy with that last shot. Yep. Big edge. Very in. quick out there, managing to stop it and preventing four runs. Let's see if they can get the ball up into the slot like before. So crucial to follow up that last delivery and keep the batter under pressure. Yeah. Yay! Strong appeal. A wonderful delivery to get the edge. You've got to keep hammering away at that spot time and again. Waiting. Yep. West Indies weren't given much of an opportunity. A very tidy over. Muzarabani from the river end. and precision in that shot. Well, that was a really solid shot. Read the length early to get onto the front foot, and that raced away for four. Muzarabani shouldn't be too worried about that last ball. They've got them playing their shots, just need to tighten their areas now. Win on! Straight to the fielder. Maybe they didn't pick it up. Very late on the shot. We are. They've picked the gap. Perfect timing. Good running. It needed to be as well. Probably closer than they expected. Yeah, yeah. Into the gap. Nice shot. Had all the time in the world to get in position to play that ball. Timed it nicely for four runs. Just need to keep it simple. Line and length, around about off stump, and that'll force the mistake. Yep. That's great fielding. That ball was flying. Did well just to get it down towards third for some runs. Waiting. No runs on that occasion, got into position nicely, just too early on the shot, couldn't find a gap. End of the over, 10 off it. West Indies are three, the 46. Beaten on the drive. Nice. That's a wild one. Nothing elegant about that shot, just not timing it at all. Poor play.
Great shot. Right out of the textbook. Off the middle, and it flew to the boundary. A boundary off the last ball. Is it a sign they're trying to push the run rate? Waiting. That's yeah. off the middle of the bat. That was a boundary the moment the ball left the bat. Can't time that any better. Perfection. What else do they have in their bag of tricks? Not much seems to be working at the moment. Wait. Finds the fielder with that shot. Hit that well off the back foot, but couldn't beat the field. Edge. Cornwall will be frustrated with that shot. The ball was there to hit, but couldn't find the gap. We've reached the end of the fielding restrictions. There'll be changes to the field, I imagine. Three more fielders can be moved outside the circle. A new bowler is coming into the attack. Tucked it nicely into the gap. Pick up a single, rotate the strike. Drives and misses everything. Cornwall shakes their head. It was there to be hit, but couldn't make the most of it. Thick edge. Time to keep the pressure on now. Great last ball to find the edge. It's just a case of finding the same spot. Yeah. Nice shot. Runs possible. Doesn't beat the infield. Short and wide, did well to get some bat on that. Three runs added in that over. West Indies are three for 57. We've seen good control and spin from this bowler. Looking forward to seeing what they can do here. Huge edge! It was an excellent change of pace. Cornwall not picking up on it at all. The whole team goes up for that one. They feel pretty confident about this.
An innings that promised much and really, in the end, delivered very little. Pretty disappointing all round. New batter comes to the crease. Never an easy time to come in after the fall of a wicket. Yeah, yeah. Head over the ball, great shot, that's racing away. Good return, back from the deep. That gets things going, just uh, nice to get settled, start to get your first runs. Expensive over ends and a wicket coming from it. Going with spin now. Yep. That was a very foolish throw, no chance of a run out, and it's flown to the boundary. Tried for something a bit different, the last ball. The captain shouldn't mind that. If they get it right, they might just get the wicket. Yeah, yeah. That was a solid shot, driven off the front foot, fantastic cricket shot. Probably deserved more from it. Wow, that's missed a lot. Nice. A reckless heave. This batter is usually a bit more elegant in their stroke play than this. Poor batting. Yeah, edge, what a ball. Couldn't get it through the field. Gee, they're bowling well at the moment. They complete another very good over. to start the over. A trudge back to the pavilion. A disappointing display in the end. For someone with such batting skills, this goes down as a fail. The field will come up now, you'd think. Pressure should definitely be on the new batter, who strides to the middle. They'll be looking for another quick wicket. Good return there, back from the deep. Holder gets off the mark. Oh. Great shot, at least one on offer. Good bit of timing there. Just missed the line, not the worst delivery, but that was dispatched with interest. Everyone just watch that in awe. A 
good contest here at the moment. Four off the last ball, and it'll be interesting to see how the bowler can respond. Waiting. Good piece of fielding to stop some runs. Back go the stumps, yeah, missed nice. the straight ball. Really getting towards the tail end is now sixth wicket gone. There's not a lot left in this lineup. Cottrell won't have the pressure of facing up just yet. The nerves will be rattling a bit while they're at the non striker's end. They'll get at least one. There'll be one run here for them. Exquisitely done on the front foot, a gorgeous looking drive, could have been worth more. Cottrell ready to face their first ball, really needs to settle quickly and see if they can get the ball into the gaps. Yes. And they're away and nicely off the mark. I'd say it was the right shot to choose, but it was just timed badly. Just couldn't get the drive away. Well, that's perhaps a little harsh. I felt it wasn't that wide. Yep, yep. Ease through the field. There'll be runs here. It was slightly shorter, but it was seen early. Got onto the back foot quickly. Just pushed it away behind square. Ooh, That's nice. wild. Nothing elegant about that shot. Just not timing it at all. It's poor play. A bit of frustration after that shot. Went after it, but just couldn't lay a bat on it. The over comes to an end. Not many runs coming from it. Both sides need to inject some life into this game. Well, you can't just skip down the pitch like that. How that isn't a stumping, I'll never know. Yep. Edged it. Good throw from the deep, bang on target. Waiting. Oh, that yeah. is a great catch. they head back to the pavilion they'll be wishing they went about this innings a little differently not too much to speak of on the scoreboard and with that wicket we'll see a change out in the middle Hussain whose first task is getting themselves settled yes edge unplayable Hussain gets off the mark. Yep, yep. Well placed, should get a single. Driven off the front foot, fantastic cricket shot, probably expected more there. That sees the completion of the over. A good one, too. Not many opportunities to score. The left arm medium bowler is coming into the attack from the river end. Yes. 
Can't get that outside the ring field. This is everything. I don't think there was any bat on that as they come through for the single. Yep. There'll be runs here. Just a little bit wide, well picked up. And let the ball do all the work, really, just to nudge it down towards third. Up. Keep us in. Four runs added there. West Indies are seven for 96. Been some great bowling in this inning so far. Just need one more to really top it off. Oh, nice. Just need to settle down. The timing's off. These deliveries are there to be hit. Time for cool heads. Oh. That's an unbelievable shot into the crowd. That was the slow ball and it didn't fool anyone. Got the timing just right. Beautiful shot. Boundary off the last ball. What's to come off this delivery, I wonder? Yep. Big edge. Brilliant bowling. Having got the edge the previous ball, they now know the areas they need to be hitting. Good catch. Yeah. This innings just cut short before it really flourished. It looked like we'd be moving to a big, big score, but it's not to be. And with that wicket, the new batter will mark their guard. They just need to rotate the strike early on as they get settled. Straight to the fielder. No runs on that occasion, got into position nicely, just too early on the shot. Couldn't find a gap. Really good over. Takes a wicket. Keeps it tight, somehow they've got to find the boundaries. Maybe they didn't pick it up very late on that shot. There was absolutely a second on then, being a little bit too risk-averse out in the middle.
collects that one, simple as you like, inside the ring. Short and wide. Did well to get some bat on that. It was just a little bit wide, well picked up and guided nicely down towards third. Yep. Amazing delivery. That's the end of a very good over. Good pressure being put on the batters. Beaten on the drive. Beautiful slower delivery, just hitting air on that one, that was just too good. A wonderful delivery to get the edge. You've got to keep hammering away at that spot time and again. Quick onto that in the infield. Yes! Let's see if they can get the ball up into the slot like before. So crucial to follow up that last delivery and keep the batter under pressure. Knocked him over, the in-swinger right up in the block hole. It's the sort of dismissal that sees the momentum swing back to the bowler. Gone, but not for many. The team will be after a positive innings from this batter. A great opportunity to come in and put some runs on the board. Yes, yes. And with that, they're off the mark. Maybe they didn't pick it up. Very late on the shot. Yeah. Yep. Nice running between the wickets. Clipping the pads, not the bat though. End of the over, and again it's a good one for the bowling side. Not letting batters build any momentum. Muzarabani coming back into the attack. Nice shot, runs possible. Really race between the wickets after it was clipped away nicely behind square. Struck it nicely, could go to the boundary. Got the head right in line with the ball, a beautiful strike there, down the ground.
a little short on that occasion. Needs to adjust the length slightly to be just a little fuller. Too short on this pitch, and as we've seen already, makes it very easy to score. Just pivoted onto the back foot, so easily done to knock it behind square. Eight runs added there. West Indies are nine for 119. They'd look for a couple here. Good return, back from the deep. Got forward and was able to drive the ball. Lovely shot and good running. Played that beautifully. Saw the short one and got out of the way. No more of those in this over. Yep. Catch it. Caught. Yeah. Did very well to hang on. Not a lot of room, so close to the boundary. This pitch and in these conditions, it's going to take something really special from the bowlers to. This total is well below par, and the openers are going to be looking to close this out quickly. The bowlers are going to have to find someone to make up for the rest of the team's batting failures. Doesn't beat the infield. Lovely shot to start the innings. Unfortunate, they just couldn't find a gap. Yep. Zimbabwe, get underway, easy as you like, with a single. A big opportunity. They've worked hard in recent weeks. They should have the confidence to build an innings and get big runs on the board. Yep. Comfortable single if they take it. Short and wide. Did well to get some bat on that. Finds the fielder with that shot. Yes. There'll be one run here for them. And they're away and nicely off the mark. They'll push hard, should get back for two. Good return there, back from the deep. 
Got forward well and was able to drive the ball. A lovely shot and good running. End of the over, five off it. Zimbabwe are none the five. The right arm pace bowler is coming into the attack from the river end. Drives and misses everything. Well, they never really got in the right position for the drive for that one. A bit of a loose shot in my reckoning. Into the gap, nice shot. A little bit short, not horribly short. Moves the feet well and the hands even better. Just need to keep it simple. Line and length, around about off stump, and that'll force the mistake. Couldn't have hit that any better. You can't fault the bowling. Sometimes your opponent is just too good. Wonderful front foot shot, and there was absolutely no point in chasing that. Poran, I don't think, will be too happy with their bowler at the moment. Good piece of fielding to stop some runs. Not a great delivery, got it full and lucky not to be hit to the boundary. Yes! Thick edge! Keepers. Time to keep the pressure on now. Great last ball to find the edge. It's just a case of finding the same spot. Yes. That's the over. Zimbabwe are none for 15. Couldn't get it through the field. Hit that well off the back foot, but couldn't beat the field. Yeah, yeah. Huge edge. Nearly got through them. Just got onto it in time with enough bat speed to pick up four. Don't need to do anything special. Line and length is the key. Too wide, it was there to be hit, and it was really given the treatment. Do they go full? Do they go short? A lot to ponder after the boundary. Wait! Can't get that outside the ring field. Massive edge. Eight runs added in that over. Zimbabwe are none for 23. Joseph from the river end. Yeah, 
here. Sounded good the moment it hit the bat. The fielder could only pick that up off the boundary rope. Punched that away through the covers with exquisite timing. A good contest here at the moment. Four off the last ball, and it'll be interesting to see how the bowler can respond. Just need to settle down. The timing's off. These deliveries are there to be hit. Time for cool heads. They must have just slipped a little in their delivery stride to bowl that no ball. Sometimes it can happen when you're trying too hard. Well placed, should get a single. Yep, yep. I don't think there's any bat on that as they come through for the single. Super shot. Well, that was a really solid shot. Read the length early to get onto the front foot, and that raced away for four. Getting nicely settled at the crease now. Would have been really happy with that last shot. Straight to the fielder. Good cricket all round, good delivery, time well, but straight to the fielder. Questions will begin to be asked. Should the captain make a change? A big over that one, too many loose deliveries. Holder coming on, obviously hoping the pace will cause some trouble. Yep, yep. Edge, there's no one there, could go down to the boundary. A brilliant throw in from the deep caps off what was a fabulous piece of fielding. A little bit of confusion out in the middle, but they've got back quickly, no harm done. Both batters survive. Wait on. No runs on that occasion, got into position nicely just too early on the shot, couldn't find a gap. Collects that one, simple as you like, inside the ring. Yep. Just a little bit wide, well picked up. And let the ball do all the work, really, just to nudge it down towards third. Yep. Picks the gap perfectly. That went all the way up toward the grandstand for four, driven away nicely. Always difficult to focus after what happened last ball, but you just got to stay positive and believe the wicket will come. Ooh. Misses everything. Nice bowling. That's wild. Nothing elegant about that shot. Just not timing it at all. It's poor play. End of the over. Seven off it. Zimbabwe are none for 42. Cottrell, the left-arm medium bowler, is coming into the attack from the river end. Yep. 
Yep. Big edge. That's great fielding. That ball was flying. Brilliant bowling. Having got the edge the previous ball, they now know the areas they need to be hitting. Yes. Well timed, but there's a fielder out there. Driven off the front foot. Fantastic cricket shot. Probably expected more there. Yes. Couldn't have played that any better. Yeah, too wide. It was there to be hit, and it was really given the treatment. The last one helped the scoring rate, making their intentions clear. Ooh. That was lovely bowling, just not getting the reward it deserved. Must have been a whisker away from hitting the wickets. Yep. Nicely fielded on the boundary. Solid partnership, 50 so far. Now it's time to really build a big score. taken yeah! had a lot of work to do and held on to a great catch this innings just cut short before it really flourished it really looked like it'd be moving on to a big big score but not to be It's a long way to walk out here just to walk straight back. They'll just want to get this first one behind them and then push on. Hit that well off the back foot but couldn't beat the field. Let's see if they can get the ball up into the slot like before. So crucial to follow up that last delivery and keep the batter under pressure. Yep. Exquisitely down the front foot, a gorgeous looking drive. Could have been worth more. Ooh. Yep. Nice running between the wickets, clipping the pads, not the bat though. Nice shot, runs possible. Did well just to get it down towards third for some runs. Yep. Too good. Not sure anyone is going to cut that off. A little flick of the wrist to get it round the corner for an easy run. Yep. They'll get at least one. Seven runs added there. Zimbabwe are one for 57. Yes. 
There'll be runs here. Right on. Quick onto that in the infield. Great shot, at least one on offer. Rolled the wrist well to keep it down, but couldn't find the gap though. A wonderful delivery to get the edge. You've got to keep hammering away at that spot time and again. Yep. Ease through the field. There'll be runs here. Yeah, yep. Onto the front foot. Super shot. It should be four. Didn't time it at all, but managed to get it away to the boundary. End of the over. Seven runs coming from it. Zimbabwe are one for 64. McCoy, the pace bowler, coming into the attack. Ooh. Misjudged that and takes a hit on the body. Timing just a little early on that occasion. Got forward and was able to drive the ball. Lovely shot and good running. Yeah, yeah. That's just silly. The power on that shot is incredible. That's the sort of shot you want to see at a cricket match. That's off the middle of the bat. Not needed. A poor line and length. Not much effort needed to hit that to the boundary. Don't mind getting hit for runs. What's important is to focus on getting the next ball right. Wow, that's missed a lot. McCoy with a superb delivery. Got them trying to drive, but messed everything up. 12 runs added there. Zimbabwe are one for 76. Yeah, yeah. There'll be one run here for them. Doesn't beat the infield. Yep. Ball is in.
Decisive running might have gotten to. Uh, looking back at it, I'd say they'd have made it easily. So in the end, poor running. After all that effort, they just couldn't manage to go on to the 100. They'll feel like they've missed out here. With the fall of that wicket, we have a new batter at the crease. Williams will be looking to make a strong start to their innings. Wait on. Over. Zimbabwe are two for 79. A bit of shape on the ball as they let it go through. Tailed just a little at the end as it went through to the keeper. Yes! Got that away nicely. That ball was just an invitation that was accepted by return of post. McCoy will be disappointed with that delivery. Good shot, it's found the gap. Got to the boundary, last ball, punches it into the gap to get a single. Excellent batting. Yep. Absolutely nailed it. You can't fault the bowling. Sometimes your opponent is just too good. Wonderful front foot shot, and there was absolutely no point in chasing that. Boundary off the last ball. What's to come off this delivery, I wonder? Yep, yep. Time that brilliantly. You can't fault that shot. Nicely played, and it was four runs all the way. Williams is really starting to get on top of this bowling. May need a few changes to halt this momentum. Yep. Very quick out there, managing to stop it and preventing four runs. Really race between the wickets after it was clipped away nicely behind square. End of the over, 16 runs coming from it. Zimbabwe are two for 95. Yep. There's a run here, surely. Short and wide, did well to get some bat on that. really high don't think anyone is close avoided the fielders one bounce and four fantastic shots Poran I don't think will be too happy with their bowler at the moment Head over the ball, great shot, that's racing away. 
The half century is in sight. More shots like that, and they'll be well on their way to 100. A little short on that occasion. Needs to adjust the length slightly to be just a little fuller. Too short on this pitch. And as yep. we've seen already, it makes it very easy to score. And that brings up the batsman's half century. Picks up 50 with that shot. A great way to start their innings. Now's the time to push on. Showed great skill, lovely timing. The boundary was the only place that ball was heading. Do they go full? Do they go short? A lot to ponder after the boundary. Wait. A beauty, yeah. brilliant catch. Trudge back to the pavilion. A disappointing display in the end for someone with such batting skills. This one goes down as a fail. Raza comes out to bat in a bit of form, but it'll be interesting to see how they go today. Nicked it! Bowler is confident on this one. Taken! A really good one, too. Another one gone, the fourth wicket is in the bag. A bit of trouble if there was another to fall quickly. We've seen some very good bowling. Coming to the wicket, they'll be looking to play within the V early and expand as they get settled. Well placed, should get a single. Immediately underway with some runs. Raza ready to face their first ball. Really needs to settle quickly and see if they can get the ball into the gaps. Yep. And they're away and nicely off the mark. Got forward well and was able to drive the ball. A lovely shot and good running. Can't get that outside the ring field. Four runs added there. Zimbabwe are four for 112. Cornwall from the river end. Waiting. Go! 
on. Yeah. Not a great shot to start the over. Starting to get really interesting now. That's the fifth wicket, and a very frustrated person is heading back to the pavilion. Misses everything. Oh, yes, the slow one beats the bat. Didn't pick it out the hand. the wicket Ooh. misses nice played all around that it was a nice slower ball and not far from those stumps yep. that's great fielding that ball was flying that gets things going just uh, nice to get settled start to get your first runs Lots of pressure coming into bat. We'll have to wait, though, to face their first ball. Yes. Nicely clipped off the pads. What a great shot that was. Onto the front foot really quickly. No stopping that one. They shouldn't get too discouraged with that last ball. The first step as a bowler is to get the batter playing, which they've managed. If they can find the right spot, the reward will eventually come. What a lovely shot, and it flew to the boundary. That's clearly not the type of delivery to be bowling. Always difficult to focus after what happened last ball, but you just got to stay positive and believe the wicket will come. I think that's called for the front foot. Not by much, but that doesn't matter. They want to make use of the extra delivery. Edged it. Finds the fielder with that shot. Great bowling. After the previous ball, they've done well to limit the damage. Time to keep the pressure on now. Great last ball to find the edge. It's just a case of finding the same spot. A little bit of wobble on that ball, and it's safely taken by the keeper. Not enough on it to entice a shot, though. That win never looked in doubt from very early in the match. It's been a great performance and a deserved win.